damn, that's, that's, that's pretty cool. Alright, welcome to Echo. This is a uh, sci-fi game. I think it's horror as well. I hope not. If it isn't, frick that shiz. Might as well commit to... Anywho. Yeah, so I guess we can just start up. I already did. I already tried this once. But, right at the end, everything crashed! So, that's freaking GG, boys. Right. Well, I mean, no, actually, no, I didn't do that much. I just did, like, the first few stuff. Anywho, you're flashing the social under the palace through separate doors. Only the strong minded body will turn against all that. Ah. about it. A magical place of life without end. A palace of untold wonders. But only for the worthy. So our lives were desperately dedicated to qualify. Pinpoint perspective on the great reward. Only... I never wanted to go. Those words alone could mean death. So when I ran, I knew it meant never stopping to catch my breath. If I wanted to live. And so it was. The place I spent my whole life escaping. Oh, interesting. I feel like shit. Of course you do. Your wound has healed. The pain is from the stasis and will pass within a week. The nausea will linger. Probably intensify when you start to realize that more than a hundred years have passed. Everything you knew is gone. This is not another one of your running away from home excursions. Your grandfather won't send someone to pick you up this time. That's all gone now. So you decided not to like me. <laughs> but you've had a century to plan what to say, and that's it. How about... You screwed up the best deal we ever had, or you come waltzing in here giving orders. Damn, she or roasting him. Buster died because of you, you stupid bitch. Jesus, calm down. I don't like me much either. But I can fix this. I can bring him back. I don't know how you hope to achieve that, little miss, but I suggest you start your efforts by laying back down. Loss of motor skills is common even for experienced long haulers, which I suspect you are not. Okay, well, I, I'll Space accept that. Let's, let's, over. let's go no, back like down. Can we, can we not lie down? Well, that's disappointing. Wait, let's eat this biatch. Nice, put that bed away. Can we put this bed away? Can we take out this bed? I want to sleep on this. No, we can't. Okay, well. Okay, I don't think we can interact with anymore. So! This is, this is, yeah, this is another, it looks like, seems to be one of those space station games where we're just like, you know, trapped. And somehow, miraculously, we're the only ones in this space station, and then, like, everybody dead or something. So, we do, do we go right or do we go left? I'm gonna go left. Because if right is the right way. So left is the left way. So where is he? He? Oh, you mean the cube. Yes, I had a very good look at that while you were asleep. I think you're in for a disappointment. Nothing suggests any sentience. No interface to access the thing, nor any reason to do so. There's nothing in there. It's just a pretty cube. If we knew how to operate it, we wouldn't have had to come here. This is how I see it. You don't answer to my orders, and yet you took us this far, so clearly, I'm not the only one hoping that I can achieve something. I can work with that. Not hope. Respect. For Foster. God knows why, but he wanted me here. The stupid lighter proves it. I suspect staying wasn't even an option, considering how you stumbled on board covered in blood, demanding departure a week ahead of...
of schedule. Yeah. Respect, then. That'll work, too. Respect? What are we respecting? I don't know. Is that a blue door? I think that that looks different from all the other doors. What does it say? Capsule? This is a time capsule. Can we unveil the secrets? Can we, go to, can we go to this blue? I think we actually have to go to this blue door. Wait, so is that the right path? Man? Like, wait, so is this the right one? Ooh. That also sounds like a movie, like, one of those movie noises. That was pretty cool. Rose Leslie! End! Nick Bolton, London! We're just naming cities and stuff. Okay, this, okay, this is the credit, then. never mind. Vincent Baden? Damn, that dude's a bad dude. Soren Bech! Ooh, you know, this actually looks pretty cool. I mean, like, look at that, look at that, like, nobody here. This actually, this, is, this looks pretty cozy, I don't know why. Just does. Is that the moon? Is that the, I, where are we even, are we, like, are we even, are we on, we're on, I mean, we're on a spaceship, yes, but, what the, for, that's a pretty bright, why is there, like, a single bright spot there? Is this, like, data, is that our light shining on there? What is this cube doing? We can interact with the cube. That looks like a T, is this, like, a bed? Was this a bed? This looks like a bed. Let's interact with this cube. I need a suit. <laughs> uh, I mean, that's a pretty good transition. Like, okay then. It's not ice. It's cocaine. I don't know that we can even trust what we see. This whole planet eluded detection until about a week ago. No visual cues. No gravitational pull. Nothing. Even with the exact coordinates, I nearly missed it. We're looking for a palace. Why am I not surprised? Give it a rest, will you? Can you see any structures on the planet? You're looking at it. It's all one big structure. Planet wide. No palace, though. I'm guessing it's some corporate state's illegitimate mining project from the pre requisition rush. That would explain the heavy clouding measures. The planet is most likely depleted of all resources. An empty shell. I hope the old man didn't pay too much for the coordinates. You have no idea. Just get me down there. I'll go see for myself. That's actually a pretty cool ship. I mean, it's really weird looking. I don't know why. That, though, I don't know who kind of designed that. Like, what, like what is this? Anywho. Yeah, just leave me, ship. Thanks for all you did. You should get off the like, surface too. Like, it's not like I wanted to go back, anyways. Okay. <laughs> strange place. Yeah, this is. Can we? Can we? Can we jump down? It's impressive. Really? Can we, wait, can we actually jump down? Like, let's see, let's see. Wait. Okay, no, we can't. I'm enabling the suit's right. assist mode to compensate for your inexperience. Ooh. What is this? Interact. Am I taking a crap? There's something here. What? Is, oh. Sort of release mechanism. Oh, damn. Did you hear that? It's definitely doing something. Ooh, this is, looks interesting. What do we got? Oh, it's gonna pull all these switches. Nice. It's kind of like a four-way. That that's a nice. That's actually a pretty cool looking mess. All right, look at me just jogging like I take a stroll. All right, we did it. Yeah. Wait, is there one? Okay. Oh no, we did all four. All right. Look, Can we jump down? down there. Can we jump down? It's too far to jump though. The suit will soften your landing if charged sufficiently. And if not? It will stop you from leaping. Oh, get this. Then let's jump down. Ow, my leg! The suit reads your intentions from your synaptic activity and receives commands from your voice or eye movements. A bit archaic, but Foster trusted that suit with his life. 
Cutting edge doesn't go well with space travel. The journey here alone made the suit an antique. It's not the suit's performance that worries me. Oh damn, that, that's pretty deep. Anyway, the best use. Uh, the suit stores energy and cells and some of your choice your total capacity and current charge, yada yada yada. Okay, so clearly we got only limited uses before we have to wait. Alright, let's jump down. Yay! Okay. Now, where do we go? We can't go, I don't think we can go there. I mean, do we go here or do we go... We can't go there, but we can also go here, I think. Yeah, there's a path here. Man, I feel like... I feel like I don't even know which... I feel like there's one way that's the proper way, the other one's just like... You know, fake way. This reminds me a lot of a chart. Like, I wonder how long it's been here. A composite like that should last forever, but it all looks ready to crumble. Just like my it life. Must be ancient. Oh, nice. This is, looks pretty interesting. Can we not go there? Nope. Well, frick that then. All right. What's what? what Actually, what's your what's your name? Are you gonna tell me a name? How am I supposed to? What am I supposed to call you? Oh, we have to go here. Whoops. Okay. Crouch. Yeah, you crouch. This is a crouch simulator, right? Get back up. Woohoo! Nice. This place was made for humans. It's not just a machine, mine. Most digs have a basic infrastructure if human presence should be needed. Probably also rudimentary living quarters. Doesn't mean anyone was ever here, though. Grants believe the place to be untouched by humans. A palace built by long-lost technology, patiently awaiting its first human inhabitants. And you figure this is no more than a bootleg mining operation. I should appreciate the contrast. I generally lean towards plausible explanations. Your grandfather, well, everything he believed in, he made up himself. I don't know about that. He had the coordinates right. Look around you. This obviously isn't a palace. Your man or is it? Aesthetic details wrong. He wasn't the kind of person who'd risk everything without some kind of proof. I really wouldn't get my hopes up. How do I turn down the volume on the commentary track? You are overconfident. Immature people often are. You should be taking notes every time I open my mouth. Okay then. Well, wow, looks like one person thinks this is some sort of rich, famous thing. The other one thinks this is some like loser thing, right? Nice. Are we gonna? So we're gonna slide down. Let's jump down. We're gonna slide. Yay! I'm gonna do that again. Oh, oh camera. I thought that was much deeper than it was. All right. Okay. See, I always wish this what kind of thing was like. Structures. Then, have you seen others like them since I'm such an expert? I've had my fair share of hauls based on wild speculation. It doesn't matter if it comes from desperate need or delusions of grandeur. There's never anything there but bitter disappointment. Was this with Foster? Before Foster. I got the feeling we're talking to you for ages. I've been crisscrossing the spur for a thousand years. Foster was with me for a century and a half. We can climb as well. Anyways, like I always wish the thing that existed in real life something like I don't know, just some, like in the middle of nowhere, there'd just be these giant, like, hi historical, artificial, like, uh, not artificial, but historical, like, you know what I'm trying to say, like, just things you can't explain, like, uh, I don't know, it feels, I think it'd be really cool. I can't even word out what I'm trying to, I don't even know what I'm saying right now. Anyways, oh, stairs, wow, that's so convenient. Thanks for these stairs. God, oh, never mind. These stairs are absolute pieces of garbage. Freak of that shiz. Let's safely proceed down these stairs. Look at this stair. Stair gameplay. If you've only been with Foster for a century and a half, you hardly knew him at all. I mean, we've been traveling together for a century, and we only just met. A hundred year haul is quite the extreme. Foster's longest was 16. I knew him plenty. He trusted you, and said that I could too. That you would help me. Foster didn't leave me much choice. You don't mess up a job for your grandfather, and then team up with the person you were sent out to get in the first place. You could have just handed me back. You really are naive. I think you're doing this because you believe there's a chance. 
work to get your friend back. You're so caught up in your homemade religion that you're oblivious to common sense. I warned Foster about you resourcefuls. Best not to deal with your kind. Why did he then? Get involved, I mean. Foster disagreed. And gold makes for a powerful argument. This dude taking briberies, how disappointed, man. Come on, I thought you were better than this. But how the hell? This looks like near automata at this point. Like, look at all this junk. Looks like corpses of machines and stuff. But how do we go from that pretty, like, snow palace just to this? Like, what the hell? This is the truth reality of the world, the harsh reality, man. The world, every, if, even if everything looks pretty on the, in the like, the where everyone sees, it looks like other shite at the bottom. There must be a way inside down there. That makes sense, right? looks like some kind of landing bay. It looks like nothing of the sort. You know, you're nothing like I expected from a friend of Foster's. Such an odd team. An old rescue vessel from the Requisition and a man without a past. None of our marks knew what hit them. And then we were gone. The stuff we pulled off. You wouldn't believe it. I believe it. I was one of your jobs. A thieving rich kid with a gambling problem hardly qualifies. I got the brief. Not much of an extraction, really. No one giving a shit about you where you dug down. Only challenge Foster could see was that your grandfather wanted you to willingly hand back whatever it was you stole from him. You're wrong about everything. Even Foster. I seriously doubt that I am. He was good, Foster. Always had his eye on the ball. You may think you knew him, that he felt sorry for you, but he would never let that happen. I don't know what went wrong that night, why Foster died, but I'm sure you don't understand much of it either. Sorry, I didn't mean to threaten your romance. Cute. Okay, at first this dude sounded like that guy from Accelerator Racers that like, Android. Now he just sounds like, it's like he aged like 10 years, something like that. I don't know. Oh well, anyways, are we going to this pentagon? Are we breaking into the pentagon? Is that what Finally, we do in this? Something. Oh, we also got to pull a lever. Pull, yeah. Oh, stuck. come on. I need some force. Does the gun pack any punch? Oh, we got a gun. Aim to shoot. Remember, it costs us. It costs a cell to shoot. Where, where, where do I shoot? Bam! Yeah, that, wow. that just sounded pretty cool. I like it. Yeah. I'm taking the gun offline. To preserve energy. Oh, screw you then. I need the gun. God damn it. I think we the one cool thing. Anyways, what is her name? She just still didn't tell me her name. What am I going to call? I'm going to call you Echo. Your name's going to be Echo. I'm deeming you Echo 1. Because maybe we'll find some more of you. But you'll be Echo 1. <laughs> Alright, Echo 1. Let's go. Ooh. This oh, looks... Are you getting all this? I'm with you. Damn! What are these aliens been doing? This place looks pretty. This place looks rich as frick though. He was right. It all looks completely untouched. Okay, wow, okay. I did not know aliens had this kind of sense of fashion. I mean, I think they're, I mean, I don't know where our planet is. Like, I didn't know they had the concept of chairs. And tables? What? I don't, I mean, why can't we just why can't we just steal this stuff and like make a fortune off of it? I mean, it's not like any commoners are gonna come here anytime soon. I can't. You were right about the palace. What's the plan now? We get Foster back and then we leave. I was hoping for something more specific. I suppose we're looking for some sort of apparatus like the one Gramps had. Would that be the soul sucker? I'll know it when I see it. Even if you did find the thing, this place is dead. What mythic technology might be here is now useless. We just need to power her up. Tell her that we're here. I can feel this is going to work out just fine. Shouting, press... Oh. Hello? Anyone home? Oh. I'm moving down. There must be some sort of power below the halls. Anyone home? Ooh, I did not know this. Anyone home? Damn! No. Shouting. Is that your plan? Bet it is. Anyone I mean, home? freaking, what game, what, what games do you know that have shouting Hello? as one of its features? This is Hello? already 
best game of the Anyone year, home? man. Anyone home? Obviously, we saved the best game for Anyone last. Hello? Hello? Okay, let's, let's, let's stop with the shouting. I mean, what game do you know? Was that so? Hang on. Wait, is that me? Oh, I thought that was like an alien or something. I was like, hey, that is me. Look at that shit. Look. What is that? I thought that was that looks like my shadow looks like it's following me. Anyways, that looks like we look at this. Look at look at me. Hello. They even have the Anyone face home? movement. That's that's pretty good. All right, let's move on. Do we go right or left? I'm gonna go right because we went left last time, and even though they left at the same place, we're, we're still gonna go right because right is right. Am I right? Things. Okay. They look like the stone faces at the gates between the garden terraces. Maybe it's a door of some sort. Let's we called them gate. Open the door. Then. They were supposed to make us ponder if we were worthy to pass. You're not getting through without power, and this place is dead. We're we not okay. We can't open the door then. Looks like we gotta find a generator or something. Gotta turn up the backup electricity if you know what I mean. Oh, another door. Right. Where the frick? We have to go. We have to go down, right? So. I guess we can go to the here. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Can we jump over this one? Is there already stairs? Like, are we allowed to jump? Can we jump? Yeah, we can jump! What the freak? Are we, wait, are we back at the start? Hold on, hold on. Oh, wait, okay. Oh, wait, never mind. Okay. Yeah, this is different. Never mind. Anywho. Look at that. It's a voice. It looks like a tuning fork. Yes, obviously. The resourcefuls call them voices. Strike them and let the true tone interfere to find clarity and enlightenment. Ah, of course. What does that mean? Oh, the suit detects a pattern to the sound, and the decryption is kicking in. Well, what decryption? The, the, um... Okay, okay. I mean, I can... I, why did I just scream like that? It's just a vo- Oh my god, you don't need to like... She overreacts. Anywho, all right, Echo One, we got that. I don't know what the point of that was. Did it compile something? Am I compiling right now? Is it like a background application? Do I have to like break it to the main? That's a mirror again. All right. What is this? Ooh. What are you? You look like nothing. Yay! Oh look, it's another one of those things. Yeah, hoo. Let's play some more sick beats while we're here. All right, let's strike this. Most definitely picking again. up something. I think they're pieces of a puzzle. We need more of them to find out what it is. Oh, don't tell me I have to like scavenger hunt this, or like I have to hit them in a specific order or something like that. The dead shit. What do you have to do then? Screw that. Okay, let's go downstairs. This is this is a nice, but this is a really big place. Holy, like I mean, what's the point? Look at the ah. Like, eh. And I guess we can just vault down here. Um, yep, we can. Woo! <coughs> what is it? Ooh, what is that? I bet that's an activation mechanism for the door. And we activated it? Okay, clearly not. Is there any more of those striking things? What are those things called again? I don't freaking know, because F that shiz. Gotta go. This is meaningless. Foster is dead. Some things just cannot be undone. Think about it. If you could capture the souls of the dead in a cube, and then bring the person back to life, surely it would be a huge industry. It's not like that. I know for a fact that he's in there. I have wondered how you came to believe that. But I doubt that I'll agree with your reasoning. Your resourcefuls are too far removed from reality to make sense. You've seen nothing but the bought and paid for fairy tale designed by your grandfather. Well, the reality of my fairy tale upbringing was that it was all about this place. No, even before that, my genes. Gran spent centuries creating his resourcefuls, carefully picking potential from the gene pool. We were created to come here. And this feels very real to me. Interesting. Okay, where does this long hallway lead us? Where are we now? We jump down again, I guess? Yahoo! No, Yahoo! Okay, where do we go now? Huh. Anything? Ooh, stairs. 
Come to think of it, where the hell, like... A lot of, there's so many questions, like, why am I here? Why... Ooh, ooh that looks like the, hmm. the sphere These, from... I know. We had rings exactly like them in the gardens. The suit detects a small gravity charge take this. inside the scepter. Yeah, I'm gonna Perhaps take it this. can power the big door. The pedestal looks like the activation mechanism. Oh, do we have to go back then to the big, big door and the, the, the thing? But anyways, Just like... out of curiosity, <laughs> what's the higher meaning of keeping scepters displayed inside huge rings made of gold? It does seem a bit much, even if you are filthy rich. The rings were not for show. They are part of our training. Oh. And you do what exactly? Step inside and feel wealthy? That'd be fun. Not quite. The rings spin up and the challenge is to get out in one piece. At first, staying in there is the only sane thing to do. But as the hunger comes, the rhythm of the spinning starts to sink in. At some point, you realize that starving eats away at your chance of making it out. Then the loop. No, it's way too long. Right. You almost had me going there for a while. Anyways, my question is, wait, okay, wait. Where the frick, who the hell, who the hell am I other than Echo One? Why the hell am I here? Who's this creep, old creep talking to me? Who the frick is Foster? Why is my grandfather involved in all this shiz, man? Um... By the way... I don't know if you noticed that there were no other exits from this pit than the big door. How I hope the scepter will magically make it open. It will work. Must be nice always feeling that the world will act in your favor. It doesn't, though. My guess is that you will learn this momentarily. Now screw you, old man. I'm gonna prove you wrong. I'm gonna show you that I got the power to defeat all the possibilities. Okay, let's plop this key in. Now, Boop. let's see. Yee, now watch as the door opens. Nothing. What a shock. Well, oh, frick that shit. Looks like you might be joining Foster after all, just not the way you imagined. I don't get it. What Gramps did to hundreds of resourcefuls for this? I saw it the day I came to you. The subject lies down on a marble surface with a strange silver pattern. And the silver unfolds, pierces the skin, and slithers inside. Wait, what? For half an hour it consumes everything. Oh, hold up, hold up. <laughs> All that remains is an empty slab of marble and a newly formed cube. Oh, echo we what? called it the translation. The flesh and the soul shall enter the palace through separate doors. <laughs> oh, we said it a thousand times, never realizing. I didn't catch Foster's soul in a magical cube. He was dying, and I translated him. You killed him? The fact that your grandfather did unspeakable things doesn't prove he was right? That Foster can come back? That's insane! It was the only chance we had, and believe me, I'm good at chances. I gamble for a living, remember? That's how I stayed alive all these years after leaving the gardens. Well, this time it didn't pan out. Look at you now. You think I'm giving oh, up? Oh, damn. Hey, look, the door open. I mean, the door's opening. Yay! Keyword. All I had to do was give a dramatic monologue. Hooray! Right, that's gonna do it for this Echo One. Echo, actually, not Echo One. That's her name. Her name's Echo One. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. And I'll catch you all next time.